lung cancer is it is nothing but a mountain and we can climb mountains. So yeah. Let's get to the top of it. I know how many people came up to me when we were at the climb in Los Angeles and just said, that woman, she has lung cancer, she's climbing? And I'm like, <laughs> yes, she is. She's climbing stairs and mountains. I plan to live for 100 years. And in that, in my next half of life, I am moved by purpose. I feel like before, I just kind of floated through life, but now yeah. I'm moved by purpose. There's a reason that this is the path that I walked. It's not one that I would have chosen, yeah. but if I'm on this path, I gotta make this journey worth it. I feel as though I didn't know very much about lung cancer mm -hmm. nine years ago when my grandmother was diagnosed. I knew the simple assumptions and I really had to dig in and educate myself in a time of grief. Mm. And I had to, you know, channel my grandmother's strength in, in order to just keep fighting um, where she no longer got to. We can be this huge force of change, you know? Yes. And um, I think it is, it's about coming together. Like, I, I can do a few things alone, but I just watch the power of how educating people and, them taking that knowledge and sharing it and fundraising and seeing what it does. And, you know, I just hope that we're saving more and more lives, you know, by advocating and educating. We are, we are. And like yeah. I always say, the cure is there. Someone has the cure up yeah. here. And this fundraising that we're doing is going to help provide them the tools they need to bring it to fruition. Yes. So, yes.